Animuri has reached a special court in New Delhi for the hearing in the 2G case. Those are the latest details we are getting. It's a big day. And Kanimuri, of course, just yesterday in an exclusive interview has said that she is now uh, willing to face the worst. We have Madhav as well as Vikram joining us live. Madhav, uh, tell us uh, what's your assessment of what, can, what we can expect during the course of the day? Well, quite clearly a very crucial day as far as uh, Kanimuri is uh, concerned. Uh, she will be present uh, at that the CBI court over there uh, for the hearing of the two cases. We must remember as far as it, uh, all, uh, really eyes would be on what the CBI really has to press for as far as Right, Vikram, uh, it's a big day for Kanyamudi as she's uh, now going to be facing the court. Just yesterday in, a, in an interview, she was rather confident in saying that she's now prepared to face the worst. Well, Harishri Kanimuri may be confident of, uh, and it's a big day for her, for reckoning her. We hear uh, here in Chennai, there is the, the DMK camp has rattled. Uh, they are expect, they are keenly watching the proceedings of the court. Uh, they will, uh, DMK party president and uh, Kanimuri's father, Karnanadi, is along with his ministers will be keenly uh, looking at the proceedings. In fact, he's very upset uh, at the whole uh, charge sheet that was actually uh, in which uh, Kanimuri's name was labeled. At the same time, he's also uh, advised his uh, DMK MPs to be there at the court over there in. Delhi and also be along with uh, Kanimuri to offer some kind of support, uh, uh, solidarity to uh, Kanimuri. Over here in Chennai, uh, there might not be any kind of a political, uh, drastic political decision or a knee-jerk action from the political uh, point of view. We expect that there might be some kind of action only after the polls because uh, Arigri and some of his supporters are adamant that the ties with the Congress needs to continue. So we might not expect any kind of a knee-jerk reaction politically over here in Chennai. Right, for our viewers just joining in, this is the big news. The DMK MP Kanimuri, who's put up a brave face yesterday, a day ahead of her appearance before the special court in the CBI for her alleged involvement with the 2G Spectrum case. In fact, uh, she spoke with the media yesterday uh, in, in an exclusive interview to Times. Now, here's what she had to say. Come out of it clean. And uh, we have said that the DMK has said, and the leader also has said, that we will face the entire thing legally and we will face it legally. I believe in the legal system of the country and abide by it. So, whatever the court decides, I respect it. Right, Vikram, uh, tell us a little bit about the mood within the DMK as uh, Kanimuri is all set to appear before the CBI court. Well, Harishri, the mood over here on the DMK camp is one of apprehension. The, both the party president and uh, Karanadi's father, Kan, uh, Kar father Karanadi, will be keenly watching at the proceedings. He is along with his uh, senior ministers like uh, Dore Murugan and Ponmudi, who will be accompanying him. Uh, and at the uh, chief minister's residence, they are with him. They will look at what the proceedings are. Uh, they will actually wait to come out with some kind of a decision uh, or some kind of a statement only after the proceedings are over. That's what we expect. They are keeping their fingers crossed at this point of time. Harishri? Right, Madhav is also now joining us live. Madhav, a very big day as uh, one of the prominent politicians is now expected to depose before the CBI court. Looking at the track record and the way the corporates have been in all sorts of trouble, it seems like there could be little respite for Kanimuri as well. Well, yes, that's certainly the case. Uh, certainly a lot of uh, uh, speculation uh, arrived that uh, whether Kanimori would really be taken uh, into custody by CBI. Of course, that uh, is something that we need to see uh, really what happens at uh, uh, really uh, the court. Uh, uh, Kanimori, of course, left Tamil Nadu Bhavan about an hour back uh, uh, to arrive at the Patiala House Court, the CBI special court over there at Patiala House Court. As, as you were rightly mentioning, a huge number of corporates who have already been taken into custody as far as the entire 2G case is concerned and also really uh, the charges that have been pressed against them, very similar to charges that have been pressed against Kanimori. But really one needs to see what the CBI, which is the investigating agency in this case, has to actually say uh, in the court. They have questioned Kanimori in the past uh, at the Kalanga TV headquarters uh, uh, there in Chennai. But really, as of now, what the CBI feels as far as this investigation is concerned, whether they have been able to find any kind of evidence, any solid evidence, or whether in fact uh, uh, they feel there is any need to take uh, Kanimori into custody. That's really the big question. And one would really have to see uh, what uh, CBI says in court today at the Patiala House Court when uh, the court does convene within the next half an hour to one hour.